Hey guys, I have a great Halloween party favor craft idea for us to do today. It was provided by Oriental Trading to me to give my honest opinion. They didn't pay me. This is all my opinion. Before we get started, I want you guys to check out this great animated news channel. It's called Tomo News and they are paying anyone $2,000 for real life interesting video footage. Check this out. Did you just capture something newsworthy on camera? Then send us your videos now and win $2,000. Visit here for more details. All you need to do is submit your video footage to the link that's in my description box. And you'll be eligible for the $2,000 prize. So just click the link in my description box below and check out the Tomo News channel for great animated news stories from around the world. Also, while you're there, subscribe to them. So for Halloween party favors, especially for kids, these are so cool. They are, um, it's soap. It smells wonderful and it has a toy inside. Now, Oriental Trading has all sorts of things you can put inside these soaps. They have really great um, toys that you can put inside. And they also sell the ingredients to make the soap. They also sent me these cool little bendy people. I love the kitty. He's so cute. And here's a pumpkin. And a candy corn man. And a spider dude. And they also sent me these plastic little spiders to put inside the soap. So... Here is how I made them. You're going to need soap, soap coloring, soap smell good oil, glitter, bendy characters, any sort of toy, and soap molds. So the first thing you want to do is take your soap and cut it into small pieces. What I do is cut large circles and then cut them into smaller little chunks. And Oriental Trading does sell this soap, and you can also find it in Hobby Lobby. So I cut it into small pieces, and I put it into this cup. And then I'm going to put the cup in the microwave for 1 minute and 30 seconds. Make sure you keep an eye on it. Don't let it boil. Once it comes out, it looks like this. And now's the time to put in your smell good. So I put in my essential oils and my coloring. I'm actually going to make it a darker orange than this. And you can also put in glitter, very fine glitter. Don't use the chunky glitter, use the extra fine glitter. So just mix your smell and your coloring in. The next step is to pour a little bit into the mold. Then you want to place in your toys face down because it looks better on the other side. So I'm placing my spiders in face down. And then I'm going to pour Actually, I have some bubbles here. If you have bubbles like I do, you can take some alcohol in a spray bottle and spray away the bubbles. That just makes it more clear. And then I poured in the rest of my soap. And they moved because I poured my soap in too fast. I'm just going to move them back. And I have some bubbles, so I'm going to spray it with alcohol again. So it's really easy. Just do it step by step. Pour in the soap, put in the toys backwards, then pour some more soap on top of that. Then you're going to put them in the freezer for about 15 minutes. After they're in the freezer, you can just pop them out of the mold. And they look like this. They're pretty cool. See, they look better on that side. That's why we put our toys backwards. Okay, to make the um, bendy toy soaps, it's the exact same way. Pour in the soap. Then put in your character. Make sure you put them in backwards, face down. And then you pour the soap on top of that. If you have any bubbles, you can spray it with the alcohol spray. And if you're wondering what smell I used, I used a combination of lemon and vanilla. So here are the soap molds after I froze them for 15 minutes. They look so pretty. I love the sparkles. 
I also wrap them up to give them as gifts. They look much better when you wrap them up. Ta-da! Here are the spiders. I love the glittery spiders. I wish I had done them all that way. I think the glittery soap is my favorite. <laughs> it's so glittery. Look, it's so pretty. But these make great party favorite gifts, and they're fun to make with your kids. Who wouldn't want to do these? So I want to know what you guys think of these. And if you've made some, let me know some ideas that you put inside for Halloween. Did you put spiders, fake bugs, fake fingers? There are all sorts of things you can find on orientaltrading.com. Thanks for watching.